Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to connect a wireless printer to a wireless network. So as you can see right here, I have my wireless printer in front of me and I'm going to show you the process for connecting it to the wireless network. Now I will be showing you the instructions for this Canon PIXMA wireless printer. However, um, you may have to take these instructions and you may have to alter them very, very slightly to work with your specific printer. However, the, the majority of, of wireless printers will follow a very 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 similar process for connecting them to a wireless network so let's start off by taking a look right over here there is a Wi-Fi light right here and it is off so this Wi-Fi light will turn on when the Wi-Fi feature of the printer is active and is turned on the Wi-Fi feature is not turned on so let's go ahead and we're gonna start it off you're going to start off by looking for either a setup or a maintenance section of the menu. So I'm just going to go ahead and you can see that there's setup right here. I'm going to select that. Okay. Now you're going to look for a wireless network or a wireless LAN setup, something of that sort. One of those options. Um, it's going to say something like that. So let's go ahead. Wireless LAN setup. Perform wireless LAN setup for connection. That is the one that we want. I'm going to hit OK. Now it says wireless LAN is inactive. Activate. I'm going to go ahead and click yes. So I'm going to hit OK. It is activating. OK. Um, uh, so we have just activated, uh, we have just changed the wireless LAN section, uh, the wireless LAN feature um, to become active. Let's take a look at that light. You can see that the wi you can see that the Wi-Fi wi light is currently on, which means that the Wi-Fi feature is active. So you have um, there are two options now: easy setup or other setup. Now, other setup will usually um, cause you to input the information manually into the printer but easy setup just provides you with the information it's a little bit easier so I'm gonna go ahead and click OK for easy setup it's just gonna search for the access points now I'm just gonna blur this information out because these are the Wi-Fi networks that are nearby the printer um, and I don't want to expose any information so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna select the Wi-Fi network that I would like to connect to and it is already on it right now so I'm just gonna hit OK all right, now it says enter passphrase. So now I need to enter the uh, the password for the for the Wi-Fi network. So once again, I'm going to blur this all out. I'm, I might even skip over it entirely, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to enter the password. So to do that, I'm going to hit this button because that says enter slash edit. It brings up a keyboard and I'm just going to go ahead and enter the password. Once again, I'm going to skip over this um, in the video so that I don't expose any information and I don't bore you as I am moving through the letters. Okay, so I have entered the password and I'm just using my finger right here to blur out, uh, to block out the password. I'm just going to hit the OK button right here and now it's going to be connecting to the access point which is the Wi-Fi network. It says connected to the access point, press OK, so I'm just going to press OK and that's basically it. I have connected the wireless printer to the wireless network. It is literally that simple. And I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to hit the back button to get out of this menu. Just like that and just get back to sort of the main menu, the main printing menu right here. Now the one thing that you have to do once you have connected a, a wireless printer to a wireless network is to um, more than likely install any appropriate drivers or software for the printer on your computer so that you can actually print from your computer. So once you've connected the printer, um, the wireless printer to the Wi-Fi network, to the wireless network, um, you should definitely be sure to install any software or any appropriate drivers that are needed to actually print on the printer. 
And that's basically it. In this video, I have shown you how to connect a wireless printer to a wireless network. I have used step-by-step -step instructions to show you the entire process. And once again, I have done this with a Canon PIXMA printer. Um, however, the majority of printers will use a very, very similar process. So you may have to just change some of the instructions very, very slightly to work with your specific printer. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.